Jillian Bell and Isla Fisher. In fact, Jillian Bell didn't get enough credit for her recent film, Britney Runs a Marathon. That was incredible. I highly recommend that if you're looking for something to watch. Although we're getting into holiday season where all you want to do is watch holiday movies. Me too! Although, of course, also it's typically awards season, although that seems to have been pushed back a little bit because the Academy Awards have been pushed back. That kind of works for me, making January, February awards season instead of having them have to compete with the holidays. Maybe we'll keep it this way? I don't know. They like, they're, pretty, they're pretty big sticklers for the calendar year. Anyway, you know what else, who else I like? I like Anna Kendrick and Bill Hader, and Noel didn't really work out. I mean, it was pleasant enough, but it really felt like a streaming movie. I hope that this looks a little bit better. All right, let's take a look. It hits Disney Plus December 4th. That's right around the corner. Let's see if it's how holiday-ish this really is. All right, here we go. This is Eleanor, the motherland's youngest trainee. All she wanted was to be a real fairy godmother. Recite it with me, please. This reminds me of The Witcher. Turns a frown upside down. Ooh, I know that I can do this. I'm gonna prove that people still need fairy godmothers. This will be funny. This is like enchanted a little bit. I'm looking for Mackenzie Walsh. Let's see what we can find. Siri, search Mackenzie Walsh. Okay, here's what I found. <laughs> Who said that? Is there a genie in there? Don't answer that. I'm looking for a sad little girl named Mackenzie Walsh. That is me. No, it can't be you. You're old. Have you seen yourself? Security. Me again? <gasps> I'm your fairy godmother. <laughs> They're a good Back team. Off, lady. Good morning. <gasps> oh, good. You're awake, too. Oh, it is a Christmas movie! Love? Not anymore. Life isn't always a fairy tale. I came all this way to help you find your heart's desire. You know what you need? The makeover! What? Oh. Yeah! I can my eyebrows. Oh. Magic. My house. I know, right? <laughs> I turn my dog into a pig! The spell got away from me. <laughs> oh, it's okay. He's just here to help with the housework. <laughs> I know you want to help, but life isn't as simple as happily ever after. Fine. After all, nine out of ten fairy tales begin with once upon a time something amazing happened while she was drinking wine in her sweatpants. <laughs> I've been trapped in the fairy tale when the real world is full of so much more. You're starting to believe in magic, aren't you? Are you sure I can't make you a ball gown before I go? Hey, please wait. No, please don't. Not in the <gasps> Oh, no. <gasps> <gasps> nice dress. Is it new? <gasps> she looks like an Don't evil step mad. sister. I like the concept a lot. I'm not sure about the execution, you know, fairy tales in a modern world. Um, but I like these two actresses so much, and it does have holiday elements in it. I'm in! So what do you think? How do you, I mean, I mean, again, this looks like a Disney Plus movie. I mean, if, if there's no way this would play in theaters. I can't, I would, I, I mean, I would hope that this was always intended to be on Disney Plus, right? Like if I were a studio executive, I'd be like, so you knew I was going to invent a streaming service, I take it. <laughs> because there's no way this could play in theaters. Has this, I mean, maybe someday, in the, and maybe, maybe, are we like the future and like traditional release strategies or like the fairy godmother and she, you know, we're now we're like, this movie would never play in theaters. But like, now that I think about it in the nineties or even the two thousands, it, it probably would have, and maybe it would have had a decent shot. But these days, I mean, you can just look at a movie and you know where it belongs and this belongs on Disney plus, but we all have 73 million ha people have Disney plus and the number is continually climbing. So what do you think? Uh, are you a fan of Jillian Bell and Isla Fisher? Uh, share your thoughts down below, subscribe today. And of course, as always, you can check out some more videos right now.